What's going on YouTube? Welcome to Cletus Selden has no life or sometimes has a life. Today is the weekly Funko News. Part one and part two. In part one, I go over the Funko Pops that I picked up for the week uh, in the previous week. And two, I go over the Funko um, the Funko blog, the pops that were re uh, that were released and that are on their way. Also, I go over the pops that you should look out for in this uh, for this upcoming week in part two. So, huh, I wanted to do the weekly Funko Roundup in my suit, sitting down, and do all that stuff, but I literally got to go in like 20 minutes, um, and I'm gone for the rest of the day. I'm not going to have enough time to upload this till later on tonight, where you're watching it now. So, part one, um, you guys saw that we went to Fourth World Comics, and we went to Hot Topic. Um, those two stores were perfect. Um, I didn't get to find some pops, which are going to be on my part two uh, of this of this whole thing uh, of the fun uh, weekly Funko Roundup, as of what I am in search of for. So I was happy with the pops that I did get, though, uh, especially at Fourth World Comics. I picked up a lot of common pops that I needed, as well as going to Hot Topic and getting some exclusives. So when we went to um, for fourth World Comics, we were able to get. Oh, by the way, as the shirt, this is an awesome shirt. Felivi got me this. It's all 90s. All 90s. All 90s. My problem is, it didn't come with a tag with front and back, but after putting on a few times, I figured it out. Uh, anyways, I was able to get from there. It was Storm uh, from there. Uh, very cool. There was eyes, pretty dope. Uh, as well as Archangel uh, that I took out of the box. Oh my god, he gets it. I can't believe he took it out of the box. Took it out of the box. Archangel. <laughs> Bobblehead. Uh, another pop that we got from there was. Whoa! The Brain. We were able to pick up the, the Brain. Uh, so we have Pinky and the Brain. Look out for the review of those guys. Uh, of that. As well as. Yakko. Yakko. We have Dot. We had a Dot already. So we got Yakko. And where's my boy? Wacko. Wacko, Yakko, and Dot. Blah, 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 blah. Yakko, any man, yeah. Okay. So, um, two other pops that I needed. Dr. Willy. Um, Mega Man is complete. I have all of them now. Whoa, blocking my beautiful face. Next up, Proto Man. Proto Man, Proto Man. I'm uh, glad to have this. Uh, somebody actually offered me, uh, my Hot Topic uh, Dorb 2000 piece limited for this. But, uh, whatever. You must have thought I was in search of it that bad. No, I was just looking for it and that was that. Um, so yes. Next up, another pop that I got done so that I can do a review. I haven't had a chance to do a review for it yet was the Bell and the Beauty and the Beast series. Um, this series is actually going to be in part two as well because the movie's coming up and their pops are out. Uh, now at Hot Topic, one of the pops that we were in search of and we must had, and that was Rita from Hot Topic. Um, nice that they keep into the same theme that they did in the old uh, uh, Mighty Morph Power Rangers with the same villains. Next up, um, let me grab the other one to, to read. I forgot that I got it. Aha! Uh -huh. Found him, found him. He was on the uh, Star Wars section, I guess, when I did put him in the, box, uh, the bag, put him on there, put him right out of And that was the Chasing Joker Pop, a Hot Topic exclusive, as, like the Rita. Uh, this pop wasn't hard to find, there was definitely multiple of them. The Chase figure was very hard to find, and uh, people have skyrocketed that price to over, uh, up to 100 bucks. I've seen them sell for on uh, a few sites, McCarty. But, that was two, four, six, eight, nine, ten, I don't know, ten pops that we picked up this week. It was definitely a interesting week of um, searching for those pops. Um, in part two, I will show tell you guys the pops that I'm continuing to be looking for this week that I wasn't able to get this week for my weekly Funko Roundup. But we definitely made a lot of good Funko videos, including the uh, top ten tag rail video, which was very, very fun. And exciting to do so that was it for this week's weekly Funko Roundup part one ha! oh shit bye